Hi guys and welcome back to another episode of Homsa 2 again. Well today we are driving yet again on Newcastle and I'm playing it a lot but I want to play all the routes with all the right hand drive buses so I can save up a good list of right hand drive buses. So yeah, um, yeah, <laughs> and I've interrupted myself. So we're driving route 46 as I said in the last video. So we're route 46 along the same route that the X40 goes but it turns off soon. Yeah we are going to have that missing um, we're going to have that missing tile, I think it is, missing tile, so, unfortunately, but, yeah, um, we'll just carry on like it doesn't exist, so, yeah, so we're driving today the Volvo B70L and the Volvo, or slash Volvo B90L, I can't remember which one I'm driving, I should be able to tell by the sounds, I think it's B90L, I think it's the B90L because it makes up, um, sound, it makes up, very similar sound. So yeah, we're driving it in the stagecoach livery. This livery came with the bus and I've just noticed, which is driving it now, that it's actually made for this map, stagecoach in Newcastle. So yeah, in recent news regarding these buses with stagecoach, most of the buses that are like this that stagecoach have are X first and most of them have entered service now across, the, apart from being transferred over to each Scotland. They went up to Scotland and now they come back down and um, round like the area where they originated, like Chester. And at this time they've gone to East East Midlands, I think it is. I think it's East Midlands. Where they've been converted to open top and empty service in Cleethorpes and Skegness around that area. So now they're open toppers. So yeah. I don't think this is actually in that time. I don't know if you have any more of them. As far as I know they don't, as far as I know they're the only ones that they have the X first one, so you'll probably tell me in the comments if I'm wrong or one night, so yeah, probably will. I'm hoping to drive a couple other routes on this map, seeing as I'm driving this with like the missing tile, so yeah, I might drive 31 or something, or the 36, I'll have to say, I think they're short 10 minute routes, it's just I've seen someone who's created who's edited the Optair Solo, um, I think it's the Bus Gamer, I think it is, I think that's the name of him, and he's edited the Optair Solo and I was, um, I've sent him a comment thing as he's replied, I asked him if he'd be creating the um, Root Master and the Open Topper in the same way, and he said he might do them, so that'd be quite good, if we can drive the Root Master and the Open Topper with passengers, that'd be something a bit different. I know the Optair Solo has that now because he's created it and that's hopefully what I'll be driving on Newcastle seeing as it's in stagecoach colours and we'll hopefully also be driving the Master at some point as well in the near future. I might even just, if it, if it can't make it, it's too complicated or something, I don't know how it all works. I might just do like a little short drive of it just to see how it, it is. Saying that I did do a mini review of it but I just like the bus so much, I don't usually drive with it. But I just, I like how the bus is, the boot master is just something a bit unusual that I think is fantastic being brought into the game. So that soon is going to be complemented by RD1s and London South, who's creating a couple of buses and things. He's creating um, a couple of buses and a fair few routes and he's going to sell them it, as far as I know, for pounds, but I'll have to say. I have him, I don't the price slightly because he's creating more routes than most other creators ever create. So yeah, and he's only getting a pound for that, I think it's a bit, a bit, a bit ridiculous to be honest. But it's up to him. It's up to him and just leave that to him. But I think he's creating, as far as I know, he's creating the Boris Martos, the MBFL, the new bus for London. The Enviro 400 MMC version. Um, he's also creating the Enviro 200 MMC and I think that's it, I'm not sure if he's creating a couple of others but I personally rather than created the Dennis Tridents and these type of buses and Plaxton Presidents because they're, I like the old, older buses, I'm not a fan of like all the new, I do like the new stuff but I do prefer the older, I'm not saying I, I hate new buses, I do like them, I like the new technologies. But I just like older buses a bit more. I just like those a bit more. I'm also thinking of starting to drive in my mouse. I tested it out yesterday 
on Balamere Island. Um, some people were, some people joined me to watch me broadcasts yesterday. I did two. I did a full, nearly a full drive on um, nearly a full drive on Balamere Island. My work in progress on service one or two, and then I did like a short two minutes before the broadcast decided to fail of Innsbruck. I did a little drive of that with Indy Survivors of Van or 12 First Livery. So if you were along to that, I know I only had like one or two people watching. Yeah, if you were along to that, I hope you enjoyed it. But yeah, um, also I might um, start organising broadcasts. Can you tell me in the comments what you think about that? So now we've got 68 subscribers, we are becoming a bigger channel. Um, don't worry, that's not. I'm not going to become professional, I'm going to stay as I am. And <laughs> we're not going to get into that kind of thing. Take a ticket. This is what I love, it comes up with the full thing and then the um, numbers and things, it all works. That's what I love about the Wayfarer. It's just fantastic and then all the money works as well. So I love like this map and Kedal Stone's money where they use the um, German ticketing but they translate it into, you know, like English money. As well as this, I know there's one map, I'm not sure if it is Kedal Stone. But they translate the um, what it means in German to what it means in British. So I know the Far Shiner is a day rider, and without them translating that, I wouldn't have known. I'd have guessed it would have been a return, but it's actually a Far Shiner is a. I think I'm saying that right. A Far Shiner is a day a day rider thanks to one map's tickets. So yeah, and I think a Targis car day is like a week or something. Don't quote me on anything else, but I know that a, I know that a far shiner is a day rider. So that that's about me done. Who's <laughs> that knowing that? I don't know if you guys want, but I'm thinking I'm thinking of maybe driving, um, maybe driving Chicago when you guys are watching. Um, so I'll record a video of Chicago if you guys want. I might because. I don't want to record like the same thing that everybody else is doing because all it is is just the 124, the 130, the 124, the 130 in the same box. Everybody's testing it out for their own opinions. And I don't want to be the generic. Pardon me. I want to be something a bit different. And when I mean different, I mean either like using the buses on under the map or being a bit different and using another bus. I'm thinking I'm slightly tempted to use this new bus that I'm downloading as I record, as I like speak in a way I am recording is weird. We'll just we'll just leave that. Um but yeah. Um download downloading slash downloaded this American bus. I think it's the RTS GMC or something. It's a mix between those. I can't remember the exact name but I know Amazon Bus UK did a video of it. And it looks absolutely fantastic. Um, the features on the bus looks fantastic. The destination worked, the doors worked, and the sounds were just glorious. So I might do a review video of that and a recording video of that. I have to say, yeah, um, as be far in the video if you saw that, it is going to pause slightly because it's going to try and load up the tile that it won't be able to upload. I won't be able to load up, so it's going to start. Um, blocky with screen you won't be able to see like the layered screens because of the setting that I record on because I record now so I can see the FPS I used to record so I could see the time but now I record to see the FPS just like just for that I can record in two options on them so I decide to do that so yeah and that's I can't record layered screens on this setting so that's what's coming up that's why it's pausing so as we can see yeah it doesn't exist so as before, um, probably do this when I'm driving a couple of other routes on this map. Hopefully with the update solo, that is just going to be like fantastic. Um, yeah, oh, so yeah, I will be missing that out and I know this doesn't exist so I'll just stop here. So yeah, I will join you in about seconds time for you, about two minutes for me. So yeah. And we're back. Um, back in the room. So yeah. This is where we make a different turn to the X40, the X40, 46A and the 45 go straight forwards. Meanwhile, us, the 46, turn left and go around the estate to turn around at the terminus. So yeah, it's very confusing because it only says like the 46 and 45 and 
before I drove the X40, I didn't tell you guys, I had to check where the route went. So before I recorded, it took me like 20 minutes to have to go along the route manually with a mouse and see where I went. Because I honestly didn't have a clue because it didn't show me at all. So that was a bit of a pain. Sorry about the loading, it's just because I'm near that tile. As soon as I get away from that missing tile, it should be around now. It should stop being like that. Yeah. In my opinion, I think the next bus to AD156 needs to refurbish. Is um, the Beat and BLE Renown. Because that's a fantastic bus. It's absolutely awesome. And I think it just needs to refurbish that. Oh gosh, someone else wants to get off. I think, is that everyone? Is that, oh my gosh, there's just always one. Just trying to pull over for you, sir. Uh, there we go. Happy. Oh, sorry, love you, missed your stop. I can't stop again. Oh, that's one of those annoying Toyotas that's static that don't move. <laughs> you can drive those um, in Omsi as a bus. Um, the person who created the sounds just made them with noise. I could, if I wanted, create the sounds for you now, but you'd all probably have a headache. Like I did when I was driving it. So yeah, I bet that's really not a good idea. So yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll just divert ourselves from that disaster that might occur. So yeah. I, I want to make sure that I'm not recording to like, high, you know, pitched into the microphone. Thing on the recording device because I don't want to record so it's all muffled and I don't want to record so it's all like laid back relaxed. I don't know what you guys think of this I'm just laid back on the sofa now so tell me what you guys think of that I don't know and I'd usually record like this what I might do is with the Opto Solo I might drive the return journey of the 46 because I don't want to do another route. I won't tell you what I'll do. Is I might drive the return journey of the 46A. Because I know I'm doing all the 46, the X40, the 46A, all around the same road. But it's just nice, you know, to cover one area of the map. But there's no point in me saying that. But I want, I know I'll go on about it absolutely loads. And I know some of you will be sick of it. But. Please, please tell me what you think. What do you think I should do? What what routes do you think I should drive? Can you get um who's listening to this? If you can get back to me within like like a day, maybe two days, comment please on what route you'd like me to drive on Newcastle. Um and I'll try and get it working. I know I can't drive the 38 as the depot, I have some issues with the depot non existent. So I can't drive the 38, and there's a couple of other routes, so I'll see what suggestions I get, and I'll see if I can fit to those suggestions as much as possible. And anyway, we're not just restricted to this map, um, you can choose whatever map you want. So in regards, if you want to choose um, me to drive, let's say... Um, I don't know. I don't know. Let, let me know what you think. Let me know what you think. I've just downloaded this map called Mains with the um, City G, so if you want to suggest a route on that. So let me know. We've finished this video now, so thanks guys for watching. Subscribe for gaming videos. Hope to see you in the next video I make. Thanks for watching. Subscribe and yeah, thanks. Goodbye.